I wanted to do a quick and slightly belated reveal for you of the latest addition to my handbag collection. It is another Rebecca Minkoff bag that I got for Mother's Day. I have tried to rewrap it up here as best as I could to do the reveal. This all happened because I mentioned to my husband that the bag that I'd been looking at on eBay was actually cheaper than some flowers. So <laughs> this is what the boys got me for Mother's Day. I have, of course, already opened it. It didn't come with a dust bag, but it did come all wrapped up in this material here. You can kind of get a hint of what it is in there because I wrapped it so badly. It's not a new style for me. It's one that I already have and love, so I knew that I would adore this. It's this beautiful little Rebecca Minkoff Mini Mac bag. It's this lovely blue-gray color, which I think, based on the color of the lining, might be, but I'm not 100% certain, the 2012 Sky Grey. It's got the gold tone hardware. It's in actually really good condition for a second hand bag, especially if it is the 2012 one that I think it is. It's this gorgeous, gorgeous shade. I'm very happy with it. And that bright blue lining there. It does have a little bit of wear. There is a little bit of wear to the hardware where the gold plating's coming off and you can see the silver underneath, but still really happy with this. It is beautiful. And as you may know from watching my other videos, I do have a lot of mini Mac bags. I love them. They're the great go-to bag for me. Just fits all my essentials in it so beautifully. Another reason that I love the color of this bag is because it's very similar to another one that I have, my Balenciaga Day. So that's in the Tempeh shade. It's a little bit more blue toned, a little bit less gray, but they are very similar colors. And so I love this shade of blue. It's so nice. I'll show you what's inside as well. I usually carry just the essentials with me and that's why the mini Mac bag is perfect. Something like my wallet. My car keys as well. So there's no fabric pocket in this. It just goes right inside there with the rest of the things. And then because we are in <laughs> the world with coronavirus, I actually have uh, not one, but two hand sanitizers, one with alcohol for the kids because it kills the virus and one without for me because the alcohol based ones kill my hands. And then last but not least, my phone goes in there too. So it's not overstuffed by any means. I could probably fit a few more things in there, but just for the state that the world is now, I'm not really going out very often. I just need my car keys to drive, my wallet because it's got like my IDs and stuff in it if I do actually need to go to the shops and of course hand sanitizer because everyone has to have that now. I'll show you what the bag looks like when worn as well. So this is what the mini Mac bag looks like when worn, just worn over the shoulder on me. It's a nice length, not too long even though I'm petite, but wearing it crossbody is definitely my favourite way to wear it. I hope you enjoyed the short and sweet reveal of this Rebecca Minkoff mini Mac bag. It is a gorgeous addition to my collection. I really, really like the colour and it's nice to have another bag with gold hardware as well. I was a little bit delayed in getting the video up. I apologise. Um, this was a Mother's Day present. It's just taken me a while to get around to filming and uploading. And so if you follow me on Instagram, you'll already know because I've been wearing this bag quite a lot since I got it. It's so cute. The mini Mac bag really is my favourite Rebecca Minkoff bag, it's a perfect size for me. If you did enjoy this video, you can give it a big thumbs up. Thank you very much for those of you who do that, and thank you for watching. Slightly delayed, and yeah, that bright blue. <clears throat> Focus.